welcome to the 50th annual Junior Sandcastle Building Competition. Or the Adjbasic, for short. The rules are simple. We put one hour on the clock, and the team with the tallest sandcastle at the end wins. This year, we have some of the finest young builders in the district competing for the ultimate trophy. Uh, we'll fix that later. Let's meet our teams. First up, we have the High Twins, Emma and Emily. And qualifying for their first time ever, Jimba and Alinta. And qualifying solely by the beautiful handwriting on their application form, Nick and Costa Kappa. And of course, the Tui kids, Salome and Jonathan. We also have our coach for this year. Yes, we do, Penny. Please welcome seven-time Junior Sandcastle winner, Josefa Tui. He will be in close communication with our chief lifeguard and keeper of the coast, Pa Eli. We are in safe hands today. Um, I believe you are forgetting someone. Uh, um, there seems to be another coach. Another coach? Indeed. I am one-time semi-finalist Peter Kappa. Should have been twice if it wasn't for that Todd Hennessy. Okay. Let's get on with the competition. Let the building begin! About time, hey, Tux. The first part of building a sandcastle is choosing some good real estate. Yes, signified by the putting of the spade into the sand. Hey, kids, don't build down near the water. Come further inland. But everyone's building down there. Trust me, I'm seven-time champion, remember? You don't want to be building down there today. Hey, girls, did you hear? We need to build further up this way. And build a sandcastle with dry sand? You're already trying to sabotage us, Jonathan. I wasn't! I did! See yeah, Jono, quit trying to camouflage us. With all the teams finding their ideal spot, it's now time to see how they're going to form the foundations of their sandcastles. Hey, Ratu, Penny, can one of you help me down to the water? I want to splash my feet. Mom, we're trying to do the commentary thing. Can it wait? Oh, thanks, Tux. Ah, Tux, your castle is coming along nicely. Wow! The teams this year are trying a new method with their groundwork. Seashells! That's it, kids. They will do nicely. Hey, kids, use rocks. Rocks? But the rocks are all so far away. Just trust me. There's no foundation stronger than a rock. Rocks? Don't listen to him, kids. By the time they're done collecting rocks, you'll have a skyscraper. I have to say, Ratu, it is a beautiful day for sandcastle building. That water looks divine. Ratu, Benny, are you free yet? We really do have some high-class talent in today's competition. It looks like Jimba and Alinta are getting a huge lead over the rest of the teams. See, what did I tell you? These are some fantastic foundations, everyone. Oh, I did warn them. <laughs> I didn't think of the little crabs. <laughs> Just like that, they've gone from first to last. They'll need a miracle to come back from here. Jimbo will be absolutely... Hold that thought, bro. They're now moving on to one of my favourite parts of Sandcastle building. Fortification. Ah, yes. To those watching the tournament for the first time, this is the process of reinforcing the walls of the castle to prevent it from toppling over. Oh, who could forget the great sandcastle fall of 98? I know Peter won't forget. That's Coach Peter to you. Dad, you've won this thing before. 
Technically, I've never... What do you think we should use to strengthen our castle? You can't go past seaweed. Grab some from over there and twist it through the sand. Hey, boys. I'd give the seaweed a miss, eh? The birds around here love that stuff. Try some driftwood instead. Don't be ridiculous, Josepha. Who ever heard of a seagull eating seaweed? Oh, I'm not worried about the seagull. <laughs> Way late. Now that's entertainment. Did you see that pelican tux? So many exciting twists and turns in this competition as the Kappa Kids fall behind. It looks like the final two contenders are the Twins and the Tuis. With only 10 minutes left, this competition could come right down to the wire. I don't know, Ratu. I think Emma and Emily have got this. Go Twins! Hmm, not sure I'm a fan of your biased commentary, bro. Emma, Emily, I really recommend you move to another location. And start again? With 10 minutes to go? Are you crazy? Just too good. Don't give up, guys. You've got this. Come on. I wouldn't be so sure, Josepha. There's only 15 seconds left on the clock. It's coming in. When? Now. Oh! Watch out! Watch out! Here comes the kick time! Finish! So much drama! The Tui Kids take the win with only seconds to go! We won! We won! We did it! We won! Who would have thought? A king tied! Who would have thought, eh? Finally, some cool water on my toes! Oh no! Ratu! Benny! I really do need help! Ratu! And so concludes the 50th annual Junior Sandcastle competition. Ratu, any final thoughts? Uh, yes. What do you want for dinner on the way home? I meant final thoughts about today's competition. Oh, yeah. Um, who won again? Salome and Jono. How much love niece and nephew? They won? Yay! That's great news! It was literally a few minutes ago, Ratu. There you go. So, what are we getting on the way home for dinner? The Tui! The Tui!